I like the dramatic difference between today's Democratic Party and today's Republican Party. I really do. I love this difference. With New York City in complete crisis, the mayor there wasted time and money with a stupid stunt to try to bait Donald Trump by painting a giant Black Lives Matter mural on the on the street on Fifth Avenue facing Trump Tower. That's that's what he does to lead. The mayor of Seattle is standing by helplessly watching as now a veto-proof majority of Seattle City Council agrees to defund the police by more than 50%. Seven of the nine city council members are now supportive of the plan. They're, they want to cut the budget of $409 million to pay police officers to make sure that they have, you know, bulletproof vests, cars that work, you know, cruisers, uniform. They want to cut that budget by 50% in 2020, as well as whatever's left, excuse me, 50% in the 2021 budget, as well as whatever's remaining in 2020. A 50% defunding of the police and the mayor and the Democrats there are emboldened by this. And finally, we now know everything you need to know about the Democrats and tearing down public property like statues of Christopher Columbus. There is no more there is no more prominent leader of today's Democrats than Nancy Pelosi. And she's an Italian. She's an Italian American. And she was asked about the toppling of statues, particularly tearing down the Christopher Columbus statue in Baltimore, which she's quite familiar with. A statue that comes down by a mob, tears it down from its pedestal, Christopher Columbus, and throws it in the harbor. Whatever you think of the history of Christopher Columbus, Whatever you think of the history of George Washington, whatever you think of the history of Abraham Lincoln, one might think you shouldn't destroy the statues if you're in a mob. A city, a state, a government shouldn't condone that, should not support that. Make no mistake, today's Democrat Party does. People will do what they do. It, it's, it's a, it is a, I do think that from a safety standpoint, uh, it would be a good idea to uh, have it taken down if the community doesn't want it. I don't know that it has to be a commission, uh, but it just could be a, a, a community view. And sometimes it's something that's been there, that view has been there for a while. They do what they do. You know, might be people might get injured as they're, oh, I don't know, tearing a 20-foot statue down, but they do what they do. I don't know that we need to commission. Nancy Pelosi refused, refused to condemn or even criticize tearing down statues of Christopher freaking Columbus. <laughs> I'm sorry. You know what? There, we, we've got to, we really have to have faith that Americans, right, left, in the middle, agnostic, you, there is no doubt that there is a gigantic difference between Democrats and Republicans when it comes to mob rule, dangerous, cr uh, crazy, ideologies, radical viewpoints, there's just no doubt. 